Before you watch this video, I want you to try hard to forget about what you think racism is. Here's my backstory. What is racism? It's described as prejudice, discrimination, or antagonism directed against a person or people on the basis of their membership in a particular race or ethnic group. You see, racism is like a log in the road, a sprinter's hurdle, a cheating lover, or a burning bridge. At some point, we got to get over it, hop over it, or simply go around it. And yes, racism will always exist for some, but it doesn't have to exist for you. And no, that doesn't mean turning a blind eye to the movement. It means crossing that bridge of uncertainty and becoming a freedom thinker. Minorities are pretty much jumped into racism like a gang would its members. Before you know it, the symbolic emblem for racism is embedded in our DNA unknowingly. We are all on that burning bridge, but some of us are afraid to cross because on the other side is the unknown. You see, we have been looking at this the wrong way. Racism is a superpower. Yeah, I said it. I know it hurts, but it's like a banged pinky toe, a car accident, breast cancer, or an unknown illness. Its purpose is to bring you to the present and undoubtedly make you stronger. Without racism, would there be an MLK, Ali? Serena, Aretha, Chavez, Robinson, Oprah, Obama, the end of ACP, the list goes on. Tyler Perry created a major studio because he wasn't invited to have a seat at the table. So he built his own. Now, I am in no means advocating for the progression of racism. I say use it to focus and become strategic about your purpose. Finally, the media, blogs, newspapers all use racism to keep us angry. Have you ever wondered why every story starts with black man at the store or white woman killed, Hispanic child abducted, Asian woman fights off burglar? It's a triggering mechanism, an auto suggestion solely to keep you in line with their destructive narrative. You click it, you share it, and racism continues. They are literally banking on it. But what does all this really mean? It means you have a choice to make. You get to stay a victim riding the wave of discrimination, bias, unfairness, prejudice, and hatred. Or you get to take back the narrative of, I thrive regardless of my perceived hardships as it pertains to my color. And trust me, no one will be able to stop you. I hope you enjoyed that backstory. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button for more backstories.